A Taco Bell in Lexington is under fire after a video of a manager making racist comments towards an employee went viral. 10 News reporter Alyssa Ray spoke with that employee and is working for you tonight to find out how the franchise is handling the situation. A TikTok from a video inside this Taco Bell in Lexington has gone viral with more than 730,000 views. Today we spoke with the employee who took the video and says he's since lost his job. It's sweeping the floor because he is black. It's mopping the floor because he is black. A TikTok showing a Taco Bell manager making racist remarks towards an employee has gotten the attention of social media. My video wasn't out there. If I didn't have a video and it was just hearsay stuff, I don't think nothing would have happened. I think I'd have still been out of a job and they'd have still been working there happily ever after. The employee who took the video, who will call Lennard to honor his request to remain anonymous, says he was sent home after the video was taken and told not to come back the next day as scheduled. She told me I can leave. I said, I'm not leaving until 11. That's my usual time that my general manager put on there. She said, well, I don't need you. So we had words back and forth about me leaving, about me not coming in tomorrow, about how she didn't need me. Since the TikTok went viral, Lennard says his family has received death threats. I also got a threatened message from a number saying that they was going to kill me and my kids and to hope that they hope that I keep the same energy when I'm holding my kids lifeless bodies. I went to the Lexington Taco Bell to see if anyone would speak with us about the video. They declined to comment, but corporate released this statement, quote, we take this seriously. Our franchisee who owns and operates this location immediately addressed the incident in line with their policies and has informed us that the person seen in the video is no longer working for them. As for Lennard's employment, he says he was fired because of the video, but has since been offered his job back. Lennard called the local police about the death threats. They tell us they're investigating. In Lexington, Alyssa Ray, 10 News, working for you.